Welcome back to another episode of my Lilith Borderlands 1 playthrough, and in this episode I am going to... Tartarus Station. Um, I'm going to skip the Nox DLC until playthrough 2. Uh, I'm going to do this one, because I think this one's got less, less XP in it, and... Uh, yeah, I don't know. Just doing that. Our so here's the intro. Began when the Hyperion Corporation decided they'd had enough of the treasure hunters. With the vault on lockdown, they had served their purpose. And now they were a drain on the economy. Why pay full price for weapons when you can take a five finger discount off the nearest corpse? Hyperion was looking to clear up the drain, but those guys were one tough hairball. I thought you said the treasure hunters were the drain. Now they're the hairball? Uh, well, yes, uh, you see, the treasure hunters were blocking the flow of, uh, uh, and the grimy buildup of money and. Uh, this metaphor stinks. Uh, uh, shut up! Point is, Hyperion had a plan. The treasure hunters could handle all manner of beastie, bandit, and battalion, but they weren't expecting the interplanetary ninja assassin claptrap. This claptrap was programmed to take our boys out indirectly, trapping, poisoning, spreading catty rumors around town. Nothing was off limits. He was smart, too smart. He looked around and didn't like what he saw. Claptraps being subjugated, humiliated, obliterated. What we call programming, he called slavery. So he rallied his fellow claptraps and turned them against their corporate masters. What started as a rebellion became a revolution and take a wild guess who Hyperion called to clean up the mess. I love it. So yeah, I think this one's a lot shorter than Nox and I figure I'll burn through the story mode on this one, farm that uh, chest room for a little bit and move on to uh, playthrough two. I know, I think there's another backpack has to you in this. Atomic batteries to power, turbines to speed. Ooh, I wonder what this does. Greetings. I'm going to need a nuclear reaction to generate the 1.21. Oh, hey, hello. Welcome to my secret lab. Secret lab? Terror pavilion, yes. I like that one best. Hey. Look like you're into experimentation. Maybe dabbled a bit in college. Head down to the Hyperion dump to find parts for my totally legit, in no way morally reprehensible secret project here. There should be plenty of scrapped claptraps right for the picking. Sure are a lot more of the buggers puttering around. It'll be easier than stealing candy from a dead baby. There we go. That's more little talk. Or uh, Tannis talk, and that's what I like. Okay, so is this the one over here? Uh, I did uh, equip my corrosive stuff for this one. Because I figured this gun's going to do damn good in this DLC. Even though it's still level way low. Love those things. Oh, there's a chest up there. I'm going that way first then. This should be a real cinch. After doing what I just did. Badass over there. And he's gonna melt. Wow, there's a lot of guys here. More than I thought. I just want to check that chest. Can you guys just leave me alone?
or something. Ever. Hey, cross of rocket launcher. I could have fun with that. Uh, replace my shotgun with it, maybe. Thought I saw another chest on top of one of these buildings. Yep. Ooh. How does that compare to my corrosive shotgun? Um, not as good. God, the reload on this thing is so terrible. This map is, this is a cool map, I forgot how much I loved it. There's just so many guys, there we go. Yeah, this is where I would come and just fight Claptraps forever. Oh, I forgot about these Hyperion guys. I love that uh, enemy design now that I'm looking at it. That was just uh, legendary money. Might have been just legendary money. There's loot galore. It's uh, nice to see loot dropping again. Is there anything up here? So much shooting. So little actual damage. Move on and just stop killing those guys all day because, uh, once again, I'm we'll trying to do this with minimal XP. But I'm bad at, like, not killing everything. Okay. Let's see what's around here. I kind of want to re-explore all this stuff too, because I kind of remember loving these maps. And there could be secrets around any corner that I just don't remember. Try to get them before uh, you guys let me know I missed them. New climbing up here had to be something. 
Ooh, what's here? And another claptrap component. God, this map is cool. All damage. I really wondered, do any of you guys know, did they nerf that or make that less? So I seem to remember actually getting hurt by fall damage in this game, but uh, like that little amount of fall damage is pretty much nothing. So I'm wondering, like, after they took it out in Borderlands 2, did they lower it in this Borderlands? themselves on accident. Kind of seems like they were killing themselves. And survey the area. Don't see any chests. This map. Oh shit, right over here. Almost missed a part. So, this dead end should have something cool in it. I mean, dead ends always do. Yep, yeah, there's a chest. There are a lot of those guys. What the fuck? They at least give me like more than one at a time. That's what I went to the end of the line for. Whatever. That's fine. It's not like I had to go far down that path. <clears throat> oh, done. I really don't need to pick all these up because my backpack's probably going to fill up with junk. But oh well. It is what it is. I have a hard time not picking things up on the ground. And that's it. One of those turn into uh, clap skags. Oh, probably got to turn around up there. Just skip those guys. Should be some shit up here. Oh, turret. Just spawn camping here. Get rid of that barrel before it gets me.
rid of that psycho go. Oh well. Let's grab this stuff. There you are. Now I'm just gonna go around and kill all these guys, and I'll find my claptrap. Uh, one thing I'm gonna give Borderlands credit for here is Nova shields have more of like an oomph to them, at least the sound effect of when they go off. Like they feel like they mean business. Whereas Borderlands 2, just okay, the Nova went off. I kind of miss that. That boom is nice. more base to it, you know? Okay, where is my claptrap bar? That's not a, that's just a bad texture. How are you? I know it's not in this stuff, I'm just opening that stuff up to open it. Oh, it does, right there. Okay. Component number four. Quick check out the map. Oh, I think I did miss that middle path, but so be it. Like I said, I'm trying to do this on low XP, so if I miss a few chests, I miss a few chests. I'll get them in the playthrough too. Okay, so this is back where I started. On full circle. And is that it right there? Nice. I like the flies. Okay. Make my way back to Tannis here. Oh, I didn't even see these vendors coming in. Let's see what we've got. for a bit. I might have fun with it. We got money roll in. And... Ooh. That might come in handy during this uh, DLC. Venom, Interglow, Mind Games. Why not? If you want to get to the vault first, you're gonna need to eliminate the competition. I think I've bought all these that I want. Did I buy the sniper? No. Not using those. I bought grenades. Don't need launcher. Don't need repeaters. Got that. I got that. And okay. Well, let's go back to Tannis. I'll probably hit level 40 here. Oh, I forgot about these. Is it too much to get an on-level masher? Nope. Get more component. Wait, these are just all those damn side quest ones. I need to go Greetings. down here to this Blake. This is Mr. Blake, Senior Vice yeah. President in charge of mercenary relations and tourism for the Hyperion Corporation. You know... The company Hello there, whose good troops friend. you just ruthlessly slaughtered. I like that. Choose initiative. Meet me at the Hyperion Tourist and Information Center, and I'll make it worth your while. Okay. Yeah, with my pestilent to fire and my uh, 
whatever shotgun I have having corrosive that uh, plague barracom might be cool. Guys yeah, just hanging out. I thought I had to fight guys in this town. Oops, I want to go to Blake. Hey, I've got a job for you. Meet me at my shop. No, Marcus. Well, if it isn't our little band of corporate raiders. Where'd you go? Over here. It's too bad he can't run away. Crucial. Without a successful phase one, there can be no phase two or three, and phase four would be right out. All of Tartarus Station's bridges are up. And the power is down. We need those bridges lowered in order to reach the next phases. Hyperion Corporation, building bridges to a new tomorrow. Step right up. All right. This is a good hub town. Like this hub town is just kind of large. A lot of shit in it. Startled me. Yeah, I might just uh, run around for a little bit here. Get some uh, high vantage points, see if I can see anything cool. I don't remember if there's any like chests hidden up on. S oh, there is some stuff. Can I walk across here. Nice. Sneery Thumper, almost cool. There's gotta be more rooftop secrets. Oh, there's one. How do I get to that one? That was way up there. Ah, crap. Can I get back up here? Nope, I think I gotta jump down and there. go around again somewhere. Figure out how to get up to that chest. There's way the fuck up there. Yeah, look, it's just a good size hub town. It's pretty fucking cool. There are more missions available at the Hyperion Tourist Information Board. Yeah, this is this is awesome. I know it's like slow and probably not dramatic or awesome to watch, but it's fun to explore and just like find your way around this building. I don't know. I think this is a cool game design. There's another chest there. Sweet. Alright, so that one. Doesn't look too hard to get to. Whoa, that's not what I wanted to do. Maybe up here I can get up there. Uh, maybe it's this way. there. So... Nice. 
Nice. Fuck, there's another one. I don't remember all these chests being here. But uh, I'm digging them. So let's see how... Can I squeeze through here? I can. Looks like this is the way up. Ah, uh, maybe this isn't the way up. It should be, and it is. This one's kind of tricky to get up. Oh, shit. Saw that coming. Alright. In this episode, I jump around for chests. <laughs> oh, I wonder if I have to go onto this roof to get up there. Nope. Alright, I've almost got this figured out. It's weird that I have, like, zero memory of this. I should remember these. Did I never discover these? It's possible. Before I do that, I'm just going to look around for these ones. Oh, there we go. Then... Come on. So close. There we go. Plague bearer. Not a very great one. But kind of cool. Alright, so any other cool little uh, secrets up here? Or just go on and do the mission? Before you guys get really tired of watching this. Ever thought about settling down? We could use someone like you. Around here. Okay. Although they could add the trains actually coming in. I thought I was supposed to fight my way down here, but maybe I cheated by just dropping in. There is stuff on these, I know there was. Unless it was a side quest. What is this thing? I'm having way too much fun just exploring this town. I should just make this an episode. Just going all the way back up. It is. Yeah, I was right. And I missed the jump. Is there a way to climb up here? It's not like it's a great chest on there. Looks like I might have to do it from here. Let's try this out. Oh, I could jump down from over there. That's the ticket. Alright. Let me get that and then I'll get, get on to the mission from there. Make it. Nice. And nothing I need. Perfect. Is this down where I go? That's death. Oh, there's another chest right over here, I think. Yeah. That one. I forgot how to get to that one. 
That one's a real bitch. Hmm. All right, I always struggled with that one. I, I, I gotta look at this for a second. It's gonna bug me. Looks like... no... I gotta get here. Is it that simple? It is. For some reason I remember struggling with that more. Okay. Now I can get down to business. Unless there's more chests that I'm missing. I just found quite a few. Some I recalled, some I did not. Alright, these guys are traps. So I'm actually going to go with that. my new Plague Bearer comm here. Gotta just pick up a lot of loot. Venom. Where is that? Venom, Inner Glow, and Mind Games. Mind Games is definitely cool being boosted. Inner Glow. I'm going back to my Mark Cop stuff. Alright. Uh, before I get demolished here... Where is it? Yeah, that's way better. That gun's just too low level. And uh, on to my skill point. Get a vendor pretty soon. Which means I can sell that Plague Bearer, because that wasn't helping that much. And the shotgun was doing good, just that shotgun reload is so terrible. Maybe I need to force myself to use shotguns a little bit to get my SDU, or my, uh, whatever up. Proficiencies. Just look at that reload. Oh, shotgun's so good, but that reload is so bad. Does it have minus reload speed on the card? Nope. Just reloads that shit. Oh, this map. This map is fucking cool.
Alright. Yeah, this map was a little confusing too, because there's multiple layers for it. Uh, Gearbox does a really bad job of uh, showing layers and maps and how to do them. God, there's a lot to explore too, but if I spend all that time exploring all this shit, I'll just take forever and make this way too long. I think this episode's actually already running a little bit because of my, uh... Actually, I wanted to check my proficiencies. Yeah, I'm only level 7 with shotgun, so 10 with pistols too. It's just all SMG because the damn Merc comps are so, so freaking good. But, uh, yeah, I should try to push some shotguns and work on those a little bit. And this shotgun is badass. Probably had one of those crystal missions in it. Looks, am I supposed to go this way? Well, either way, I just gotta work my way through here. So I guess I can go this way, I think at least. Those are also claps. I should, uh. Wait till that's done. Okay. something in there? No. Oh, here we go. Sweet. Defender. Cool. Not bad, but not better than what I've got. Use this to heal up a little bit. I'll probably just get through this map and call it an episode.
how do I get up there to fight those guys? There we go. Like it. Was it all that I could be? Will pay for that. Is I like that big crit spot. And just looks like there's going to be something around here. There we go, I was right. Sometimes game design is predictable. This way, yeah, it looks like I can. Alright, so I just force myself to start off with my shotgun and switch my SMG when things get hairy. That's a nice uh, sniper, it looks like. Yep. That was cute. I'm getting really close to those skills, they're gonna make me incredibly hard to kill once I get my uh, cooldown stuff. Yeah, see, this is that thing. It's like I went right by there, I couldn't go there, so I think I have to go underneath and around. The map is so bad at kind of uh, showing you the actual direction in this. Not a land of any pellets there. And another chest. There's those turrets I was thinking of. Ooh. Ah, 22 accuracy. I don't like that. turrets. I'll play it safe until I can find them. Site scoping is terrible or sniping. What the fuck? How many shots can I miss when I'm lined up here? There we go. God, I would have been better off shooting a shotgun at it there. Now, from what I recall, there's a ton of enemies in this part. But I'm going to try to play it somewhat cautious, and... Yeah, 
and use my shotgun as much as possible. Ooh. Legendary sniper. Yeah, if this thing's reload just wasn't so terrible, it would be amazing. It's pretty freaking powerful. Alright. On here, I think these are actually my objectives here. Yeah. I like him just fine, Samurai Claptrap. Lots of ammo. Check that other side before I really move in there. Thought there's something up here, maybe. Ammo, ammo, ammo. Just ammo. Okay, zero dot bug. Legendary. Okay, I'm actually gonna quick stop here and check those out. Two hundred crits, pretty good fire rate, good damage. Battle Guardian. Ammo regen, pretty fast ammo regen. Good reload speed. Hmm. Tiny magazine. Um, yeah, I'm going to hit these up before I move on, too, because uh, my backpack's probably getting loaded up here. Is that Tormentor? And Defender. Uh, I'll hold on to those for now until I figure out what they do. Did not care for that. Eh, I'm giving up. I'm not going to use that. Uh, no. No, no. Yes. No. Alright. Get rid of these. Shit, I'm going to hit 4 million pretty soon. That's not bad. And anything cool. Alright. Put this on so I regain my SMG ammo. And run around here a bit. Sure. Yep, I think I know what's coming up here. I just didn't think it was coming up already, but... Yep. I'm back. Wait. I'm back. Damn it. Nice. 
that, I'll just skirt him around here and uh, use my shotgun for this battle because I want to. And that should uh, help my proficiencies. Or maybe this is taking too long and he's speeding up. You gotta watch out for the suicidal ones, especially. God, that beeping is loud. Alright, so I'm gonna deal with these guys first. Oh, that was almost bad. How do you like him now? Actually, he doesn't really get phased, it's just the crit stutters him. That's that. Check them out. I think they're all ammo. Supposedly that fight's supposed to take longer then. Alright. Habits, new. Not quite. 11.7 is way too low for me. There's a decent shotgun. That's yeah, more my style. These. I think there's another one underneath. Ruthless SMG, not terrible, but. Tempest. That's kind of cool. Longbow. Why can't one of these be a masher? Mercenary. Four, three, and three, but no uh, ammo. That would have been a good gun for the Iridians. You know, since I'm getting some decent stuff out of those, I'm going to keep checking these. Sorry about that. I think this episode's going kind of long. God damn it. So close to being what I want. I'm finding a lot of TDR, it seems. Hey, where's my cool Jacobs? TDR Molly Wan. See, that would have been another nice Iridium gun. Ugh. I'm gonna throw out some of my low level junk for these. Assuming those are more money. And nothing really cool here. Is that better than my. Hmm. Not really. I, I think I'd take the double 
recharge rate over a little bit of capacity there. But that's close. Um. Outstanding. You managed to make possible what my team thought impossible. Way to capitalize on that. lowered expectations. And that, uh, which is the right way out. Execute phase two of Operation Trap, 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 Trap. Um, this one had something worthwhile going this way, if I remember right. I know there's like the racks up here, like mini rack hive or whatever. Maybe it wasn't quite rack hive. Maybe this was a side quest that I had to go over here for. Yeah, because on top of those things there's stuff you had to get. See if anything cool dropped. I thought there's a chest or something here. Hmm. Maybe I'm mistaken. It could have just been the side quest. I thought remember I had to jump on top of those rocks to grab something. But at least this is a way I didn't go coming in, so I might be able to find more chests. Like this one. Nope. I've learned I'm not a huge fan of thumpers. Should go down and this way. I think this way. Yep, that'll do. If I could walk without textures getting in my way. So yeah, once I get through here, I'll definitely call this an episode. I wonder if these vendors reset. Oh god, that's another really good one, but I'm losing that ammo regen. And that 48 isn't great. If that 48 was higher, I would uh, switch it. Also, too bad they weren't able to get um, fast travels in these DLCs. There's some kind of game design issue bug that stopped them from doing it. And they uh, planned for that in Borderlands 2. That was one of those big switches they had to make. Because they built this, when they built this game, supposedly they, it was such a new thing, they didn't know how it would do, they didn't really have the plans for that stuff. Like they did for Borderlands 2. Okay, I'm going to turn this in and then call this an episode. do I turn this in at? Oh, there's the railroad. Got a little lost there. No, this isn't up here. I'm just seeing what this is. Nice little overview. Alright, Blake. Greetings, consumer. On to phase two. Our intel reports that the enemy is using a nearby factory to rebuild and refit their own claptraps. This is a clear violation of numerous patents and copyrights held by Hyperion. Also, they're constructing a robot army, which is bad as well. Lower the bridge, 
break into the facility and shut them down. And please do remember to keep your receipts, or you will not be reimbursed. Okay, I'm going to sell off some of my junk here before I... Ooh, that one's getting pretty good. Alright, I'll, I'll find an upgraded uh, Mercom soon enough. So I'm going to hold on to those, see what they're all about. I could probably drop this for some of my shock pistols I found. Oh, it's only a times two. That is still a times four. I just don't really like it. I'm selling it and forcing myself to get rid of it. Uh, for now, I'll keep with that one. That's definitely better. Why is it worthless? Oh, the accuracy, maybe. Well, that's six. That's three. That's times three. More damage, more fire rate. I like the green one better. Although... Meg's kind of a big deal. I'll take the accuracy. You sh I should only have to hit him like once to get that. Loaded up with money, sold all the stuff I didn't need. I'm going to check this vendor because it's right here. These vendors. After this cutscene, of course. It's a beautiful day on Sorry if this episode is well over an hour. Well, I just feel like it is, but I don't really know how long I've been going. Same one I've got. Why can I not get an unlevel masher? I would love an updated masher. Oh wait, how do I get in there? Okay, I'm gonna go for that one last chest. I know I keep lying and saying I'm done. I think I can drop in there, unless that's quest lock. I should be able to jump in there this way. Unless there's a cover on it. There is not. There's so many chests on this map. And nothing cool. Oh well. But uh, I'm not going to spend too much time running those chests because... Uh, there's that big room once I finish this, and I'll probably spend an entire episode How just running that. So, thanks for watching, guys, and I will talk to you later. Bye.